Hello, Sharif Medawar here, and I want to share with you how to become a multimillionaire in commercial real estate or even residential real estate in five steps and one bonus step. Well, number one, most important thing is you got to build credit. I'm not talking about uh, just uh, getting some credit cards and all this, but also business credit. You know, you can set up an LLC or a C Corp and you can actually apply for its own tax ID so it's separate from you and build credit for it. This is very important. Step one, build credit. Step two, and one of the most important things you need to do is as soon as you have the credit, you need to buy and sell assets. Buy and sell residential real estate is usually the easiest to turn around and resell. Why? Because usually people buy it based on an emotional reaction. They like it, they like the location, so they actually do it. So that's step two. You use your credit to be able to put down payments, to be able to get loans, even hard money loans, and learn how to turn around and sell these properties. How do you do that? Get some training. Learn exactly how to flip these assets because a residential real estate is based on focusing on an area, focusing on a specific type, let's say three bedroom, two bath, and understanding the values. So when you see a good deal, you can jump on it, put it under contract, either assign it or sell it, buy it and sell it, buy it, fix it and sell it. There's just so many ways to do it. So that's step two. Step one, build the credit. Step two, flip assets. Step three, you gotta have asset protection. You gotta protect your assets. There is no way you're gonna do it and make it big unless you protect your assets, especially if you're flipping real estate because there are some liabilities. Somebody's gonna wanna sue you, you're doing some rehab. The pool person wants to ask you for more money or whatever. You wanna have to learn how to protect your assets. We, we will teach you that. There's a website called kissmyassetsgoodbye.com. You'll see a video animation for three minutes, how it's done. Then step four, you need to learn to reduce taxes. Many strategies to teach you how, if you're gonna flip properties, how to pay the least amount of taxes from 1031 exchanges, if you hold it for a year, to even um, putting the right expenses, to setting up the right uh, amount of write-offs, to having tax incentives like what I have, where I pay only 15% when I flip properties in the millions of dollars. Number five, most important one, is now you reach a level where you have enough money to be able to buy and hold the real estate. Buying and holding real estate is a phenomenal way to make cash flow because that's the end goal. When you have an asset that produces cash flow, that's how you can actually borrow millions of dollars by knowing exactly how the numbers work on a commercial building. That's when you move from residential to commercial and you elevate the game. And the bonus sec, uh, one for uh, number six is to actually create your own syndication where you can raise capital to buy a property. People will give you the down payment. You put a little money, you get the loan and you can create a big game, much bigger than you've ever dreamed of. Hopefully this will help you. Best of luck to you. Keep us posted on your success. Thank you.